So for the past couple weeks, I've been going through all my stuff, and I found a couple things that I should throw away or take apart. Well, one of the things I was going to throw away was this heavy-duty styrofoam. It's really thick stuff. But it occurred to me I could actually have some fun with this instead. Back whenever I was fixing or removing the paint off that 1955 Sunbeam T20B toaster, I bought a bunch of acetone. Well, I have some left, and I've just been tripping over it. And there's about that, that much left in the container. Well, acetone actually dissolves styrofoam, and it's very interesting. So I say, let's dissolve this styrofoam. Maybe even fill up this pot with it, and see how long it takes for it to dissolve that entire piece of styrofoam. freaking cold as that evaporates. <sighs> Hand felt like it was freezing. I'll try that much first. Here we go. You. I'm having to press down a little bit because it's making a, a thick plastic layer underneath it.
Well, that was kind of cool. So what's happening here? So, well, basically the polystyrene inside of the styrofoam is dissolved by organic solvents such as acetone or gasoline. And so uh, whenever it's being dissolved, it's releasing all the air pockets that are inside the styrofoam. And right now we have a solution of polystyrene dissolved into acetone. And I believe if I keep stirring it, it the acetone will slowly evaporate, actually very quickly, because the more I'm, the more I'm stirring it, the less acetone there is in the mixture because it's going away and I think after a while it should harden and actually it seems like it is because it's getting really hard to turn The inside is very liquidy because the acetone on the inside can't evaporate away, so I'm stretching it to, make, to help it evaporate, and it is slightly getting thicker. Well, I've been playing with this one enough to where it's dried out, and it's, it's still pretty squishy, but yet it also retains its shape a little bit. Let's get that back round again, and... Oh no! Actually cleaned off. The outside is still dry enough to where it acts like a plastic on the outside, but a liquid on the inside. And the bowl of it has dried enough to where there's a thin layer of polystyrene in there. Well, this hardened quite nicely. I'll definitely have to be doing more experiments with this. Hope you enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching. See ya.